There are a lot of differences between European training and American training. So how do you combine the two together in the most efficient way and get the benefits of both worlds? Well, there is a partnership which we're going to find out about now, which does exactly that. Let's start off by talking to you, Venom, from uh, Guest Air. Yep. Now, what is your part in this partnership and how does this work for students coming in? Well, the idea here is that um, uh, we want to give the students the opportunity to take advantage of the best things of JAA and the FAA world. So what we do is, since we're based in Europe, we have a screening uh, process, we have a selection process, but actually after the students have uh, passed that selection and screening process, if they opt to go for the route, the FAA-JA route that we now uh, have together, they go to Delta in the United States, get their basic flight part done, and after that we finish the last part of it to have them also get the JAA licenses on that, so that they would finish their course with both FAA and JAA qualifications. A lot of people that haven't got interested in all this yet or really read the stuff up about it are probably going to say, well, how can there be any difference? An airline pilot is an airline pilot. So what is it about FAA training? Well, you're right. An airline pilot is an airline pilot, and that's one of the philosophies that we both work well together. Is whether you're a pilot flying in the United States, in Europe, in Asia, Australia, you should all be trained in flying with the same skill set and the same knowledge base. So one thing we're looking at working together is all the regulators have similar rules and procedures, but each one's got something that they do a little bit better than the other. So what we're taking here is we're taking so the strengths of the European JAA program, the strengths of the FAA program, and combining them so we can actually have the world-class pilot coming out of our joint program. So the point of this is to get, in a sense, the perfect global airline pilot, someone that has got the best skills from each system. That is correct. Right. Now, how would you do that, though? Because, you, you know, which is the better system? Which is the better aspects? I mean, have you sat down and said, look, we want a bit of this, we want a bit of that, this is what Delta wants, this is what other airlines want? No, it's not what Delta wants or what the other ones want. But both of us, we've been around for many years, for decades, training pilots. So, uh, and then, of course, you know the good parts and the bad parts of your own training system. Well, not your own training system, but your legislation system. Okay. So they were very aware of what were the strongest points of the FAA system, and we are very aware of what the strongest points of the JAA system are. Now, we're also aware of things, uh, obviously, since these are the two main systems in the world, worldwide uh, um, legislation uh, format anyway, we are aware of what's better in other parts of the world. So it was not, it was not uh, I mean, we sat down and had a look at the, different, uh, the differences between the two programs, but it was quite easy because we already knew which were our strongest point, and we already knew which were their strongest point, and it was quite easy to simply put that together to get the best of both worlds together in one program. Again, there's, there's kind of, you know, there is JAA training, there is FAA training, there's a lot of training schools out there doing training. So how do you find those things, which is what makes you have the best chance of getting that airline job? You need to look at the school and what are they offering. You'll, you'll find airline training is expensive. It's expensive to get into. You can spend a lot of money. So you have schools that vary in price, 50, 75, 80 percent, and you say, gosh, why is it so more at one school and not so much at the other? Uh, there's one atom. You get what you pay for. So you need to find out what is it that you need. Typically, what we do, we're a full integrated course. We really work with you every step of the way. You're not going to be left alone to try and study and figure things out. That's going to get you through the system faster, and it actually costs less in the long run because you're well prepared for every lesson you take. And that's extremely important to look at. So when you're looking at schools, you're looking at where do I want to do my training, what resources do they have, how are they going to support you, and what's their track record, how do they, where are they placing their pilots, what's their curriculum del developed from. We're owned by an airline, our curriculum comes from an airline. We know what they're looking for. Hester's got an airline, they're the same way. We have very similar philosophy and that's what's driven this partnership and why we're very excited about the product we'll have at the end of the... It's just, I know there are a lot of people out there at the moment going, look, there is a shortage of pilot jobs for, to be going for, so I need to make sure that I have got the best skills, I've got the best you know, things that I need, the best that I can offer to an airline to get those few jobs that are there. So it's that edge. What is it that you need to be looking for that is going to say, I will get a job? Well, the, the, the easiest answer is that um, one thing is getting your license, but another thing is being actually ready for your job. Okay? Now, if you want to be an airline pilot, you need to be trained in a school that is focused on airline training, on professional training. Uh, and, of course, that means that uh, using equipment that's going to be most in tone with what the airlines later are going to use when, once you are employed by that airline, uh, 
uh, schools that train according to procedures that the airlines will lose, use so that actually the transition from going flying smaller aircraft to actually flying in an operation with your captain when you should join as a co-pilot is as small as possible and the, uh, the, uh, the airlines don't need to invest a lot of time and money in training because you're actually already ready. Okay, and that's the whole idea behind our programs as well. We've got glass cockpit aircraft, both of us in, in our in our programs. Um, we've got airline operations. Uh, everything is actually, I mean, the program has been designed and the procedures we use have been designed with the airline experts we have within our own companies. So that's the whole idea behind it. I think that the easy sense, like I said, is if you want to work in an airline training in a school that's focused on airline training. I know people are gonna watch this video and start to go, okay, where do I apply? How do I get on this? What do you need to do? DeltaConnectionAcademy.com. You can go on there, find our information, submit your information to us. Hester has very simple way as well. Yeah, we've got with us is uh, www.hester.com. And uh, you can have the same procedure there, applying information, and we will get all the information you would like. Gentlemen, thanks very much for your time.